Okay. So, um, good morning po and uh, welcome po sa ating uh, training for uh, Facebook boosting. So, there are two ano po, uh, two types of boosting po, but we will cover po the easiest one, okay. yung pagbo-boost. Okay po. So, mas maganda ma'am siguro kung uh, meron kayong or kung nakaharap kayo sa computer para makikita nyo rin siya o sa laptop para makita nyo rin siya, masundan nyo po kung paano yung ating gagawing boosting. So, I'll share my screen po para po makita nyo. Um, we will simulate po yung boosting na gagawin ko sa, um, sa page namin. Okay. Okay po. So, Share ko po yung aking screen yun. Ayan. So, nakikita niyo po ma'am. Malinaw po ba? Meron po. Ayan. So, ito ma'am yung aming main page. And kung makikita niyo po, scroll down natin. This one po is currently uh, boosted. Ayan po. Kung mapapansin niyo po, message conversion po niya is... 31. So this is running for uh, five days. I think five days na po siya. Uh, five or six days. Ganyan po. Tapos po, ang reach niya na is 4.6 thousand. Ayan po. 4,600 ang na-reach niya. Sa lifetime po nung pag-boost natin sa kanya. So, yan po yung um, ginamit natin sa pagbo-boost. So, this time po, uh, maggagawa tayo ng boost for a new ads. So, let's say po itong, if you can see po, mahanap tayo ng ibang, yan, ito. Ito po yung ating bagong um, bagong product, ang ating toner and lotion. And ibo-boost po natin to. Now, this one po, um, yung boosting po is good for um good for different um, products. And during the time po nito ituturo ko sa inyo, saglit lang naman po ito, um, makikita nyo po dito kung paano po natin iseselect yung mga uh, regions or yung mga areas na gusto natin targetin sa ating boosting. So first po, ito pong dahil nationwide po yung target natin dito sa sa boost po natin, let's say po ito sa toner and sa face lotion, click po natin yung boost. Okay, ma'am, any question po, you can, ano po, ah, you can just ask me. Yes, ma'am. Ayan. So, ma'am, if you can see po, nandito po yung ating boost. Okay, so, the first thing po dito, sa so makikita nyo po dito sa taas, is goal. Okay, so yung goal po natin dito, um, pwede natin i-change kung ano po yung gusto nating uh, i-target. Meron po tayong engagement, meron din po tayong get more message. Okay, sa ang kaibahan po nito, if you are going for engagement, get more engagement, what you will get po is likes, follows, and um, comments. So, yan po yung makukuha nyo. So, every time that um, they will see or your ads will be shown to people na more likely to like, to follow, and to share your post. So, depende po sa category ng inyong page. Doon po niya isi-share yon or Facebook will share your page to people that most likely to share, to like, to follow that certain page po. Okay, sa get more messages naman po is your ads will be shown to people or to Facebook users na more likely to message. Uh, so meron na po silang algorithm yan. Recently po nagbago yung algorithm. Medyo hirap po tayo ulit mag-adjust pero right now po nakasunod naman na po ulit tayo. So Get more message. So this time po ang gagawin po natin, get more message. The reason po is because we want people to inquire regarding the business that we're offering. So we will click on get more message. 
As you can see, ma'am, we have here an automatic. Okay, so automatic means that uh, Facebook will share your post to um, to the uh, to the user or to the customers, the clients automatically. Uh, si Facebook na po ang magde-decide if you if they will share it to people that is more likely to like and to share or if they will share it to people who will or more likely to message you. So, ang gagawin po natin is get more message because we want to target people na magbe-message po sa atin to inquire regarding the product. So, let's go ahead and save that. Okay. Now, susunod po natin dyan is messaging app. So, since we choose to get more message, we have two options here. We can either route the messages to our WhatsApp or we can get the message on our messenger. Since we are not really focusing on WhatsApp, we will just uh, leave it to messenger. So, all messages will be forwarded to our messenger. Okay, so ganun po siya. Okay. So another thing ma'am dito sa messages is you can edit the welcome message. Okay. So this one po will allow you to edit the welcome message. Um, for the questions or uh, frequently asked question, you can type in any questions here. There are three questions po lagi. They will not allow you to delete one. So you have to have three questions. So can I make a purchase? Can you check the price uh, of the product or where are you located? You can change this one. Let's say, uh, what's the, sorry. What's the package prices? Okay, so ayan ma'am, na-change ko na siya. And also the greeting text. Please let us know how we can help you. You can change this one into Hi, welcome. Welcome to Just Amazing Skin Care. Okay, so you can change that one also. So um, you can type in any greeting message on uh, this part. Uh, we recommend po na to make it simple para mas, mas maging catch or you can think of a catchy question or welcome message para sa inyong mga customer. And then the uh, questions. Um, usually, the questions that they are asking is how much is the package? Where can I purchase retail? Or um, uh, where are you located? So those three questions. Most of our um, most of our ads are um, have those questions in them po. so ganun po siya. Okay, so once na na lagay niyo na po yung questions and yung greeting message, you can just click save. Okay. Um, by the way, ma'am, I'm saving this one because um, hindi ko pa siya ibubus. So this is for sample only. Okay. Okay po. Uh, Mamalino po ba yung audio ko? Yes po, clear. Okay po. Clear. Okay po. Okay. So, dito na po tayo ma'am sa next, dito yung pinaka-importante, yung audience. Okay. Who should see your ads? So, ito na po yun. So, as you can see ma'am, since ang um, last ads ko po is uh, for product, nandito po siya is Audience, uh, audience details, pero ang title po niya is already selected. We can create new po, or since ako po may mga nakasave na, I can choose one of the save, um, save audience that I created before. Pero we'll start a new one. Okay. So dito po, you can choose a name for your audience. Let's say this is a test audience. Okay. Yan po yung title. Now, we have here the gender. Men and women. You can select men and you can select women. They will or they will show your ads to women only. Pero I always select all. The reason for that one po is 
because there are some men also interested in beauty products. Hindi naman po, uh, dahil beauty products ang ating tinda is uh, they are all or women uh, are the only one interested in them. So there are men po na uh, also interested in uh, the beauty products, in our beauty products. Okay, so just leave it to um, the gender, just leave it to all. Or since uh, you can also use this on different products, Depending on the products that you're selling, pwede po nyong ilagay siya into all women or all men. So for us, here at Jazz, we just use um, all. And then next one is the age. Okay. For us, we select uh, age 24 and age up to age 50. So ganyan po yung age na gina, uh, tinatarget namin. The reason po is because we are looking for resellers, we are looking for regional uh, distributors and uh, other distributors. That's the reason po, the age is 24. Okay, we can set it to lower, uh, let's say uh, 16, if you're looking for customers. Kasi po, uh, 16 is since our product is safe for teens, we can uh, put it down uh, at age 15, 16, around those age. Pwede na po silang gumamit ito. So we can select yung age nila. But for us, for the meantime, since we are doing a regional search, distributor search, we select 24 to 50. Okay po. So, after nyo maselect po yung age, you can now go to locations. Okay, so this one po, yan. I-show nyo po yung map sa inyo since Kabanatuan po is already selected here. It's showing me the map of Kabanatuan. Okay, now since you want to target uh, um, a different area, let's say po, uh, Ma'am, saan po ang area na kayo? Ilocos, ma'am? Tama po? Yes po. Yes, po. Okay. So, ma'am, pagka tinipe nyo dito, I'll show you this one po. Ayan. Sa location po, burahin ko po ulit. So, sa location, ma'am, just type in Ilocos. Okay. So, marami pong lumalabas dito, ma'am. You can select po per, uh, per city or you can select the whole region region of Ilocos. Okay. Ah, La Union. La Union. La Union. A ah, cover ng Ilocos region yun. Yes po. Ah. yes po. Okay. So, you can select the Ilocos state or region. Yan po. So, makikita niyo po sa map. Ayan. Nag-change na po siya para po ma-cover niya yung buong uh, region 1. Ayan po. So, same thing, uh, I can remove Kabanatuan. Let's say you're going to target NCR or Metro Manila. Just type in the uh, the area and then select it. Ayan. Now, you can also do this, ma'am. Let's say po in Ilocos or in Region 1, you want to select one city only or one uh, province or one area in Ilocos. You can also type it in here. La Union, let's say. Ayan po. So, depende po kung saan area. City, the state, La Union. So, depende po kung saan nyo gustong iselect. So, you have the options po kung ganong kalaki ang maging cover ng inyong um, advertisements. Now, dito po sa baba, mapapansin nyo po, is potential reach niya is 11 million uh, 11 million na persons or uh, customers. Okay, so this one po, depende po sa laki ng inyong budget, yung marireach ng inyong ads. Pero ang potential po, maximum marireach niya po is 11 million. Dahil may selected po tayo Metro Manila and Ilocos. If I remove po Metro Manila, yan. Naging 2 million na lang po. So these are the uh, potential customers that you can reach. Uh, on your ads. 
uh, using your ads. Now, you can see here, ma'am, specific broad. Um, ang mangyayari po dito, ma'am, is if you type in a, uh, a very um, few quantity of targets, okay, pupunta po yan sa specific. Uh, and kung mapapansin nyo, ma'am, is red siya is because sometimes you go very specific or too specific that you are targeting just a few uh, customers using your ad. So they don't really recommend that. They recommend that you go on this green line. Um, most of the time, if you set your regions, your age, it will go on the middle here between the specific and the broad, uh, the middle of the green line. That is a, uh, that's a good, uh, good number or a good level of definition ng inyong ads. Okay, so detailed targeting. Okay, so detailed targeting, ma'am. Okay, so dito nyo po define kung ano yung target nyo talaga or kung sinong customers yung target nyo. As you can see, ma'am, here, uh, we, we already have some uh, suggested targeting, um, detailed targeting options. So let's say po, sa detailed targeting, we type in SOAP. Okay, so sa SOAP, ma'am, interest. Ibig sabihin po dito, all people in your area, in the 2 million uh, mark, all people interested in soaps, they will be targeted by your ads. Okay, so dyan po. So all people that shows interest sa ads na soap, that your ads will also be shown in their news feeds. Ang mangyayari po dito is if a person in your target area search for soaps, then your ads will be showing in their search results. Okay, another one, let's say po is uh, uh, the face cream. Ayan. Mm, wala, day cream. Let's say cream. Okay, so it, uh, creams. So, eto po, yung mga interested sa cream, so sila po yung makakakita. Uh, SPF. Yeah. Okay, SPF. So let's say you're uh, a person in your target area search for SPF, then your ads will be shown to them. For, for people in that area, in your target area, na nagkaroon po ng search or have interested in, uh, or interested in SPF, makikita rin po nila yung ads nyo. Let's say a person in your target area po likes a page that shows soaps and SPF protection, then your um, your ads will also also be shown in their news feeds. So ganyan po. For us po here at Jazz, we don't select a target po. We don't select a target. We don't add detailed targeting. The reason for that po is we would like everyone to see our product. Okay, good. Okay. Why? The reason po why we select or why, why we choose that is because you never know what if a person po uh, hindi siya talaga interesado or wala sa isip niya about the business. But when they sell the product, if they see the products, then what will happen is they will have interest and they will start messaging you. So uh, that's the reason po we target uh, everyone in the area, not just those interested in soaps, in creams, and in other beauty care. We target everyone to uh, to allow them to see the products and to see the benefits of the product para po maging interested sila or sometimes mm, biglaan lang naging interesado sila. So those are our targets. So you can uh, select one or uh, detail targeting, select an option here, or you can just leave it blank tulad po ng ginagawa namin. Uh, pag naglagay pala kayo dito, ma'am, let's say po, ulitin natin, SPF. 
let's say choose SPF, as you can see, ma'am, here, your potential reach goes down to a thousand people. Yan. So, there are a thousand people interested in SPF in the target area of Region 1 or La Union. Our other, our other target earlier is what's our target? Green. Okay. Okay. So, mas madami yung cream. Naging 380,000. So, these are the target people that your uh, that your ads will be showing to. So, sila yung makakita po ng ads ninyo. Okay. So, yan po. Let's go ahead and uh, I'm not gonna save this po para yan. So, let's say po na save na natin yun. The next one po is budget. Okay. So, sa budget po, uh, first thing is yung duration. Ganong katagal nyo po patatakbuhin yung ads nyo? Usually, we run an ad uh, we run an ad for about 7 to 10 days. Ganyan po. Uh, because iniikot-ikot po namin yung aming mga products. So, iba-iba pong ads per week or iba-ibang ads per month. So, depende po. So, yan po. Let's say you have uh, selected 10 in your target. Okay, pinapakita niya po dito kung kailan po mag end yung um, boost. And this one is very important, the total budget po. Yan. Dito ma'am tayo magkakaroon ng uh, um, malaking desisyon. Okay. So, Sa 10 days po, ang budget po na binigay ko is 1,500 pesos. Okay, now ma'am, if you can see here, estimated daily results. You can see here that if I put in 1,500 of budget, these are the only people that I will reach. 1,100 and 3,000 uh, or up to 3,200. So ito po yung people or yung tao na ma-reach ko sa area na target ko per day. Pwede pong 1,100 persons or 3,200 persons maximum. Pero there are times po na mas mababa pa siya dito sa estimated reach. So, yan po. And since we are targeting po messages, you can see here po sa baba, ayan, 0 to 6 people. So there are people po in that area, uh, six person in that area per day ang possible na makuha nyong mag-message sa inyong ads. There are possibility rin po na there will be zero messages in one day from the ads. Okay, so yan po. Zero to six. Let's say if I raise my budget to 2,000, let's say I raise it to 3,000, Wow. Let's change it here. Yeah. Let's erase it to 3,000. As you can see, ma'am, here sa baba, the target or the, the daily reach, estimated daily reach changed. So earlier, we just have 1,100 and 3,000. 400. So this time around, na double na siya. Since we double the uh, since we double the budget, na double din yung reach and yung estimated messages mo per day is around 4 to 12 messages. You will receive around 4 to 12 messages per day. Pwedeng tumaas, pwedeng bumaba depending on the uh, interaction of the people in the area. And uh, for this one, ma'am, Magbibase lahat yung reach mo depending on how catchy the ads will have or how catchy your pictures will have or will be on the ads. As you can see here, ma'am, uh, these are the uh, pictures that we are boosting. So, depende kung ganong kakachi yung post mo or kung ganong kakachi yung yung mga pictures, dyan po magkakaroon ng bago, pagbabago sa reach mo. There are times na we experienced um, estimated daily reach. They just gave us around 
10,000 maximum daily reach, but uh, we noticed that we're reaching about 15,000 per day. In that cases po, we are not paying extra for uh, for those extra reach. Uh, it's It just so happened na naging catchy yung pictures na ginamit namin that people are uh, are are seeing it by means of other people sharing it or the uh, other or friends of them are forwarding it to them so tumaas yung daily reach namin so that's uh, that is for the estimated daily reach now for for your area po ma'am uh, for um for targeting po a specific area may meron din po akong sinusunod na rule na if you're gonna target po an area um, make sure that the lowest budget that you have for day is 100 pesos that will allow you to get um, to get viewers and messages in one day so yun po yung ginagawa ko minimum of 100 if you're just targeting viewers So yan po. Okay, so the next one po in boosting is the placement. Okay, ma'am, hindi po ba napuputol? Okay lang po. Okay lang po. Okay, so placement. Um, by the way, ma'am, ito po palang boosting na tinuturo ko, hindi ko po nabanggit kanina, is for Facebook page. So if you have a Facebook page po, any Facebook page, pwede nyo pong i-boost yung post nyo using the system po. And then, dito na po tayo sa placement. Saan ba ilalagay ni Facebook yung inyong mga ads? So, the first one here is Facebook. So, hindi nyo po siya pwedeng i-unselect -un kasi dyan talaga pupunta yung ating ads. The second one is Instagram. Okay. So, um, for us, ma'am, we don't target Instagram anymore. The reason po is there are too many influencers in Instagram. The messages that we are receiving is only from influencers wanting to review our products. So that's the uh, that's the uh, message that we're receiving from Instagram. So there are too many influencers po, kaya po medyo hindi na po namin tinarget ang Instagram. What we target only is uh, Facebook. So we unselect po Instagram in this case. And then also we don't select Messenger. Since people are only using their messenger to if may mag-message sa kanila, so that's the time, the only time that they're open it. So to message and then close it again, back to, to Facebook. So hindi na po namin tinatarget yung messenger. We only select po Facebook. Okay, so dyan lang po kami nagtatarget ng ad sa Facebook. This is to ensure that people will be seeing our ads. So if they scroll on their Facebook, they will be seeing uh, our ads. So that's the reason why we only target Facebook. Okay, so the last one is, uh, this one is the very important one, your payment method. Okay, so our payment method is credit card. They can accept debit card or uh, other uh, other cards that will allow you to be, uh, that allows you to use it online. So meron tayong mga cards from different bank. So we are using this MasterCard. Okay, you can, uh, if you don't have a MasterCard yet on this one, it will show you to add. The process of adding it is pretty straightforward. If you can select add, add it will ask you for the uh, details of the card, the, the name on the card, the, uh, the number on the card, and at the back of the card and the expiration date. Once you input those and click next, it will verify your card. With your bank, if your bank allows online transaction to be done, then it will be automatically added on your Facebook ads. Now, what about uh, when you do another ads? If you already added the card, oh, okay. So if you already added the card, next boosting, you can also use or you can the, the option to use the MasterCard or the card will be enabled on uh, the ads that you will create. So uh, in, in our case, po, na add na namin to before and we're uh, still using it. So nandyan po siya sa Facebook. Okay, so 
after everything is done, we recommend po na i-review nyo po yung inyong post. Okay, so review the uh, goal. The messaging apps, kung saan babagsak ang ating mga messages. Since ang target natin is to get more message. The welcome message, we suggest that you review it para makita natin kung baka may typo or meron kayong message or meron kayong information that you left out. So pwede, kayo, pwede nyo idagdag. Okay, now the audience, make sure that you select the audience that you created. There are times that there are uh, other audience that is already selected so you can put it back to the original one that you create. Okay, so the dura duration and the budget. Make sure that you select this one properly, ma'am. Uh, duration and budget. Uh, sometimes po, nagkaroon kami dito ng uh, slight mix-up. Okay, what happened is I put in a budget of 10,000 for 10 days, but it seems that hindi po siya naging 10 days. Uh, based on the ads that I create, nagkamali po siya, naging one day po. So that 10,000 pesos has been used all at once in one day. So make sure that you select the uh, correct options here. So 10 days, 3,000 budget, and it will end on November 29. Okay, so another one to check, the placement. And after everything has been checked po, you can now click boost post. Okay, so once ma'am na-click na po yung boost post, hindi po yan automatic mapupunta na sa agad or mabuboost na agad yung inyong uh, post sa inyong page. It will take uh, about uh, an hour. Pinakamabilis na po. One hour for Facebook to review your post and approve it. There are some cases po na tumatagal yung review nila. Every post that you boost or every ads that you create po, Facebook is reviewing it. Tinitignan po nila, let's say, kung, um, kung wala bang uh, malicious intent yung in-ads mo. So everything po, chinecheck nila yan. Uh, ayaw na ayaw po ni Facebook uh, na merong mga uh, hint of LM, MLM. Uh, mga getting to, um, get rich quick scheme. Yung mga mabilis umaman. Ayaw niya nyan. Ayaw niya nung uh, parang you're tricking people na mabilis kang magkakapera dito. So yan po. Iniiwasan niya yan. So pagka ganun po, if Facebook na feel nila na, oy teka lang, merong something dito parang get get rich quick skin to, so they will reject the ad. Once your ad has been rejected, ino-notify po kayo ni Facebook that your ad has been rejected. And with that rejection po, nilalagay nila kung ano po yung mali. Okay, let's say they detect this has a hint of MLM, so you can change it po. You can edit the post or you can edit the ads and then click on boost again. So yun po yung mangyayari. They can, you can select an option or doon sa message po nila, you have an option there to change or to edit the uh, post para po maging fit and para i-approve nila. Pero kung wala naman po silang na-detect na something sa inyong, sa inyong ads, within one hour po, you will receive a message that your... Uh, Scheduled post is boosted. So yan po, ma, ma -re receive nyo na po na na-boost na yung inyong post and once you select or once you check, let's go back here. Uh, I want to leave, yes. Uh, again po, hindi ko sinave tong boosted post na to since po uh, we still have a running ads. So yan po. Once your ad has been approved, you will see that you have this option na po sa inyong uh, post. Nakalagay po dito kung ilan yung na-convert na message, ilan yung na-reach na people, kailan nag-start yung boost, and 
uh, finishes in one day. So, may one day pa yung ads namin. And if you choose 10 days, it will show you it finishes in 10 days. So, yan po. Yan. So, yan po yung ating boosting ng ads. Uh, you can also do this po on different pages. Let's say po you have three pages na pwede nyo gamitin to boost the page or to boost the product. Then you can just upload your product on that page and then boost it. Um, before boosting po pala the product, if you're... Uh, if you're targeting just products ang naman po to boost, then we recommend po that you create a page. Mm, uh, just like po uh, our NCR, uh, NCR South and NCR North, and also our Region Region 4B or Region 4A, I'm sorry. They are boosting po their uh, post po. Pero they created a page po just for jazz. Let's say the one is just NCR South. So, ginagamit niya po yung page na yun para i-boost po yung products. Nakakakuha din po siya ng likes sa pag-boost ng, uh, ng product na, uh, na product niya. Makakakuha din po siya ng likes. So, every time that you boost your product, uh, even if you're targeting messages, you'll, you'll still have, or you'll, 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 uh, you will also see people liking the page. So, ganun po, mas maganda po yun na nilalike din po nila yung page, dumadami yung followers ng inyong page. So, every time that you post, makikita po nila yung inyong post. So, may viewers po ang inyong product. So, uh, that's it po for boosting. Uh, Ma'am, any question po? It's a question lang. Halimbawa kasi sabi mo kailangan, Mike. Um, sorry, Ma'am, medyo mahina po. Okay Hello, Ma'am? Meron na. Okay, ma'am. Sige po. Hello? Okay na. Question Apo. ko lang. Uh, kailangan sa Facebook page siya talaga? Or kasi uh, nag-create po kasi ako ng isang Facebook. Pwede ba doon ako mag-boost? Mm. Uh, parang ibuboost niyo po siya sa personal Facebook account po. Halimbawa po, pwede po siya? Uh, let me check, ma'am. Sanggit lang pa. Huh? Ma'am, wait po ha. Check ko lang po. Yes po. Okay. Ma'am, upon checking po, hindi po siya gumagana sa, ano, sa personal. Sa personal account mo. Sa page lang po siya gagana. Okay. Sa Facebook page. So pwede naman ma'am kayo kahit bagong gawa lang naman po yung inyong uh, Facebook page for Jazz, pwede nyo pa rin po siyang i-boost doon. Yes. Thank you. So ganun po siya. Any question pa po? Uh, yun lang na, yung, yung, targ, yung pag 10 days siya, uh, yung 2,002 to 3,000 na i-reach niya, that's per day, different client, different viewers siguro yun. Ah, yes ma'am. Oh, ah, okay. Apo. Bali, um, like earlier po na nung sinilag po natin yung area nyo, you have 2 million target yes po. people in the area. So, uh -oh. um, most po, most probably po mangyayari po uh, for today, iba po yung makakita. For tomorrow, iba po yung makakita. Okay. So, that's maximum of 3,600 people per day po ang makakita. So, iba-iba po yun. Okay. Pero depende pa rin po kasi there are times po na if a customer or if a client po, a potential client, meron po kasing mga nag-search talaga araw-araw or may at may pa nag-search po ng soap or nag-search ng toner or nag-search ng beauty products. So most probably po, makita po nila ulit yung inyong ads. Kasi okay. po, bali ang mangyari po is kung ganong kadaming beses nagsa-search itong mga customers or yung mga tao dun sa area, ganun beses po, let's say, kung sino yung pinakamaraming search, ipapakita po agad ni Facebook yun dun sa tao na yun. Okay. 
So, meron po mga tao dun out of 3,000 po may mga repeat po na makakita ng inyong ad. Okay. Wala na pong okay, question. Okay. Wala na po. Yes, ma'am. Uh, wala nang question. Next na. <laughs> may next ah, okay. pa ba? 